Hello, and welcome to the GBC Productions channel. This is episode 40. Here, I have another special treat. This is a Schubert model DRV mechanical calculator from about the mid-50s. And the problem that I'm having with it is that sometimes I can't put a number in and it's very difficult to turn. In fact, I can't even get it to turn right now. Everything's bound up right there. I'm getting it to turn, but it's not smooth at all. So I'm going to open it up, probably give it a cleaning, and figure out what's wrong with it. The zeros aren't quite lined up. I'll zoom in a bit here. And I can't even move these numbers right now. So a couple of the levers are working, and some of it is sort of working, and other parts are not working at all. So I'm going to take this top cover off and see what's going on inside. All of the screws on this are slotted. Well, there is a lot of dust caked on in here. I'm going to take this lower cover off, off camera, and see how dusty it is in there, too. I got the lower cover off, and it's very dusty in there, too. So before I go any further, I'm going to take compressed air and blow all the dust out. I'm going to do that off camera. Alright, so I've used the compressed air to blow the dust out. And then I sprayed a little bit of silicone lubricant on there. And things are moving a lot smoother right now. It is still hard to crank. And I think it has to do with those upper number wheels. And I'm going to have to remove that shaft underneath it in order to get the number shaft out so I can take the number wheels off and clean them. So I got the shaft out and it's moving nice and freely. And these numbers are very hard to turn. So I'm taking them off. Then I'm going to clean the shaft and then clean a hole in the center of the wheel. I cleaned up the shaft and the numbers of course are very hard to get on and off the shaft. So I'm using a drill bit of the same diameter and very carefully clearing out the hole in the middle. And now it slides on there very smoothly. And after I'm done, I'm going to put a little silicone lubricant on there. So here's the wheels all back on. Everything's lined up properly and, and it turns very smoothly. So now I'm going to put the covers back on. I'll do that off camera. And then I'm going to test it out. So here it is reassembled, and it's all working beautifully. So now let's put some numbers into it. So let's say I'm going to start with 372. And I'll turn the handle, 
and now the number 372 is there. So say we're doing 372 times 4. So then all I need to do is just turn the crank three more times. So there it is, 372 times 4 is 488. So now I'll just reset it. So now let's do 372 plus... Thirty-seven. I'll turn the crank, and there it is, 409. And then to clear it all out, I just pull the levers, and it clears everything out. Don't forget to subscribe for more, mash that like button, and comment below. Until next time, this is Uncle D from GBC Productions, signing off.